As you probably know, 73.6% of the statistics are made up on the spot. Let's throw one more out there. Every year, the average creative loses 335 hours of productive work and around a thousand bucks due to duplicated assets. Do you want to have a clean library and save money? Keep watching. Imagine downloading the same products multiple times. This happens all the time, especially if you work in a team and there are new people joining in who don't have a good overview of the asset library. With Connector, you have quite an easy way to find these duplicates and clear them. Just run the Find Duplicate Assets tool and allow it to compare the content of the assets. You can select what types of assets you want to include in the search. Also, since we are looking for re-downloaded assets, they will probably have matching names. Check this option before launching the process. Keep in mind that the check can take substantial time, so it's a good idea to narrow down the folders in which to search. You can repeat the process numerous times. The tool remembers its latest settings. The end result is a window in which the duplicates and originals are listed. You have the nifty option to select all duplicates and delete them from your file system. Voila! Now, let's deal with another common problem, having the same asset duplicated in multiple different folders with a different name. Sometimes, that's intentional, but often these are just residuals that need removing. Again, you need to compare the content, so it's better to narrow down the asset types that will be included in the search. We will just run it on materials. The end result shows that we've been pretty sloppy with copying the same substance assets all over the place. Luckily, that can be fixed by deleting them. Keep in mind that you can do it manually by selecting from the list. Also, the assets labeled as original don't have some special features. They are just the ones with the earliest creation date. Let's move on to the third and final workflow for this video. Not everything should be about deletion and destruction. You can use the Find Duplicate Assets to get an overview of all files in your library that have the exact same name but different content. In the results screen, you can check the preview of the assets and easily open their folder by following the path. That's useful for renaming or moving them around. If you exclude the file extension from the search, you can easily find, let's say, textures right next to their original PSD or TIFF. Or you can check the different bump maps and compare them with a single click with Connector's handy integrated feature. Those are just three of the hundreds of ways in which the fine duplicate assets can help you have a better library. If you have any suggestions on how to further improve the feature, leave them in the comments. Subscribe and hit the bell icon for more video guides about Connector.